Weather coverage you can count on with meteorologist Olga Breeze and the Way 31 Storm Tracker Early Warning Radar Network. Here we go, sunset in progress, a beautiful fall day, lots of blue sky and the changing colors of the leaves. Temperatures are comfortable. We have low humidity, low dew points, and yes, a lot of sunshine across the board, plenty of blue sky. Winds are out of the west right now, and we're going to ramp up those winds a little bit as we move on into our Friday forecast. But for right now, we're just watching these temperatures drop. Decatur and Scottsboro now down to 70 degrees. And on the regional scan, you can see as we zoom in a little bit closer that we actually have some of us in the upper 60s already this evening. But it will be pleasant if you want to take that evening stroll nonetheless. The official high today, 73, after starting out very mild at 62. You'll notice that we had that cloud cover overnight. It took a while to pull on out this morning, so we did get a nice running start on a very pleasant day. Uh, rainfall totals for early this morning gone very, very slight, but look how well we are doing for the month thanks to all that rain that pushed on through yesterday. Our radar scan will be quiet. Thursday and Friday dry, Saturday is dry, but this next system approaches us Saturday night into Sunday, and that's going to bring some weekend rain opportunities. But for tonight, get out and enjoy. If you can, open up that window and let that fresh, uh, crisp air in. We'll be in the upper 50s by 8 o'clock tonight, and then we'll bottom out in the 40s for our overnight lows. The overall picture, though, is pleasant. It's going to be a great evening as we move on into tomorrow. More sunshine, still dry, so we'll end the work week on an up note. But the weekend will have two sides to it. Saturday is going to be a warmer day and much more sunny, while Sunday we're tracking that chance of rain. So for tonight, we'll be at 64 right around 7 o'clock. And then as we bottom out in the early morning hours, 42 is about the low for the city center. But as we move on into some of those suburban areas, we could even see some upper 30s. Big rain chances arrive on Sunday, not a washout. But morning and afternoon evening rain showers are possible. They'll be a little bit spotty, but then by Monday, some of those showers will linger into early Monday morning. So let me take you hour to hour with our future radar forecast model. We'll push this all the way into Saturday. That's when I think we're going to start to see the first glint of some cloud covers trying to push on through. That'll be early Saturday morning, mostly across our northern counties. Then by Saturday mid-morning and late afternoon, notice the rain opportunities well north of the viewing area. So I'm pretty confident that Saturday will remain dry, but Saturday night into Sunday, our rain opportunities will start to go up. So here's that seven-day forecast for you. Upper 70s Friday, mid 80s for Saturday before that rain arrives on Sunday. Behind the front, though, Monday's the transition day in the upper 60s, but Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday will be very chilly, especially the overnight 